switch. Switch, that's one. Jogging. Hip rotation, please. Big. Poof. 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 Switch. Knee rotation, please. We are on the beach, Miami Beach. Uh, it's amazing to practice here. Been here since uh, one week already. Come on, jump in, Jack. I'm working with Douglas Quadero, my, my fitness coach, and my, my other fitness coach, Mike. I'm here monitoring the, the heart rate. So I have a look about the condition that he has and the recovery time that he needs to, to calm down. How rate, please? 36. Perfect. Amazing. Two for a one back, two for a one yeah. back. Spring. Lateral, lateral, lateral. To here. To here. To here. Okay. Go! Push. In your toe. Push. 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 E go! Come on, come on, Dominic. Come on, Dominic. Go! Come on, go, 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 go! We do usually one session on the beach. It's, it's really tough because you have to keep the balance all the time. You have to get good power in your legs to run fast. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I mean, it changes up every day almost, so it's also most of the times fun. Go! Come on, Dominic, come on, Dominic, come on, come on, come on. Go! Fate, fate, move you on, move you on, move you on. Go, fate! One, two, three, four, and then. Okay. We got the. Okay. Back in. One. I think the main thing is that uh, if you step on court after this practice, it's, nice. it's so easy to move on a normal hard court after you did all the work in the sand. Immediately after this exercise, you see how far his heart rate is going down. This means that his aerobic capacity, his ability to make one sprint after the other is really great. That's one. Switch. Come on. Come on. E, e, e. One. E, two. E, one. Stop. Very good. good. How are you, please? Oh, 121. Amazing. The next three will be the, the plyometry with the spring up the hill. Come on. E, e. fun every day because always uh, different exercises. Go! Woof. Come on! Woof. Come on! That's one! Stop! Hi, can you move the bicycle please? Dominic is, a, is an amazing player. He working very, very hard. It's amazing the high intensity he put in every exercise. Pa! E! Pa! Nice! Woof! Nice! E! The precision is very important because if you get good precision, possible uh, it's combined good with uh, good tennis. Uh, you you can keep the performance all years. Continue. Poof. Continue. Hip. Poof. Lateral back. Lateral back. Last one. Last one. Hip. Hip. Poof. Oh my God. Solid. Amazing your coordination now. <laughs> Low. Hip. Star. Of course I'm tired, I mean, almost every day, but it's, it's okay, I'm, I'm tired all year long. We got a, a very good uh, full body workout in, now it's time for a little rest and then uh, we go on the tennis court. We are right now on Fisher Island, pretty exclusive, nice court. My coach is uh, Nicolas Massou, uh, it's not new, <laughs> so he's, uh, he's here with me, he lives in Miami, so it's perfect. Power, power, come on. Uh, Excellent. The first two weeks uh, is more physical training. So now in this moment, there he's making like two times a day physical training, so one time uh, tennis. And then uh, we are going to Australia, and then we're going to put more hours of tennis, then we're going to put uh, more attention in that. Yeah, it's so in. Yes, 
it's amazing how he practices all the time, 100%. Uh, he's very focused all the time. He tries to improve every day. So for me, like a coach, is uh, amazing because he's a guy who all the time wants to win. Twenty nineteen was a great year for me. I mean, in, in general, it was was amazing. I won both titles at home in Austria, which means a lot to me. Then I won my first Masters 1000 in New Wales. Dominic Team wins the very first Masters 1000 title of his career. He's the champion in Indian Wells. Late finals again in Roland Garros. Of course, uh, the year ended great for me with the finals in London. becomes the first Austrian to reach the final at the season-ending championships. I beat Djokovic, I beat uh, Federer, which is of course always amazing to beat these greatest players of all time. That was uh, amazing for my confidence because I'm, I'm pretty sure that we're going to see a new Grand Slam champion in 2020. Now is the time to really get the body ready because there won't be any uh, time off where I can practice like this now. So I try to use it as, as well as possible and try to get uh, the body ready for everything was what's ahead next year. Bye, bye, oh, assist legs for bye. <laughs> Another monitor session. This is a, a laser beam. Uh, we can measure the speed exactly with this. And go! Good. Ready. Go! 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 Good. So, it's now my full power, full speed. Ready, go! Go! Super, we just did 15 and uh, the last one was as fast as the first one. <laughs> now we move on with uh, Gladiator and Hercules training program. It's called the Gladiator Training. Uh, yeah, just watch and see. It's gonna be a nice workout. Go. It looks easy, but it's not. Four, eight, 12, 16, 20, 24, 26, 32. Ready and go. Now it really counts. Okay, get up. Ready and go. Go! Four. This is a build-up so he can recover in between points and he knows exactly uh, what he's capable to do. Super Tommy, last 10 seconds. Uh, he works really hard, probably one of the hardest work on the tour and uh, we have another few days we can go for the next step. 24. Yeah. Hip lift with one leg. After 20 seconds change. We are really happy with his performance because this is really a very hard training program. So within a very short uh, period of time, you had a lot of stresses on the body. From my point of view, it's a perfect training. Good. We call this Hercules. This is an, another program, short intervals, and uh, it gets faster and faster. Ready, go. Ready, go! 
Self-motivation is a very important thing. I mean, I, I have it in, in me, which is uh, very nice. But of course, there are also days where my team has to push me. I'll go. Hard work is, is the only way to repeat my, my good success in the last year and hopefully uh, even improve it. Uh, of course, it helps a little bit for the start of 2020, but there is still some room for improvement in 2020 and yeah, that's what I'm working for.